In this video, we're going to be applying agency wet look concrete sealer to this rock. Adds more color to it. It seals it. And up here in Idaho, the wet and cold, really cold climate up here causes this stuff to break and fall apart pretty easily because of the freezing and thawing. It's a good way to seal the rock, but also add a lot more color to it and add some sheen to it. I've actually hooked up a 510 Rack X fine finish tip on our sprayer here to actually spray this rock with our wet look sealer. And all you're doing is just spraying it on, getting it really saturated so it soaks in, and that's all there is to it. We're using a cardboard shield to keep it off our footings and our house. We've gone around and masked it to keep any overspray off of our house too. We used 3M2021 inch tape with 9 inch brown paper. Just using a Titan 440 airless sprayer to apply it at a pretty low pressure. Just using a 310 tip and see what the pressure is set at right here. Just going to be spraying on a nice heavy coat so the rock or your brick or stone is just completely saturated and you can go back if you want it to be a little bit shinier after the first coat and give it a second coat usually one coat is good enough you just want it, it to be completely saturated so you can see the stuff you know starting to pool on your stone and soak in going to give your stone a really nice sheen to it, nice wet look sheen. You can see how much darker it's making the rock look. We've actually added bug juice to this product too from Walla Walla and there's little spiders and stuff that get in these crevices of the stone and make spider webs so we've added bug juice to it to actually kill any flying or crawling insects that want to get inside the stone. Once again, we're just using a Titan 440 sprayer at low pressure using Sherwin Williams HNC Wet Look Clear Sealer and that's a water-based product so it cleans up easily with water. And where you're just using a Rack X fine finish tip, you don't want a tip that throws out too much or you'll start to get it puddling and running off the stone, getting drips and puddles and pouring off. Just a fine finish tip. 310 or 510 will work just, just perfect. 